You don't need another technique to manifest your specific person. All you need is confidence. Knowing that you can achieve whatever you want, you can get whatever guy you want, you can get whatever treatment you want, you can get whatever qualities in a man you want. And walking in that confidence every single day, prioritizing yourself, putting yourself on a pedestal, knowing what you want and prioritizing that, not expecting other people to make you happy, prioritizing your goals. This is what makes you sexy. This is what makes other men obsessed with you. When you prioritize yourself, when you stop placing way too much importance and attention on men. Because I see it like this, when you place way too much importance on men, this means that there's not enough importance on you, on your identity. Like, and another thing, when you do your inner work, when you prioritize yourself, when you set goals, when you achieve goals, when you strategize your life, this actually raises your vibration. You don't even need to do a technique. When you prioritize yourself, regulate your nervous system, let go of the limiting beliefs or behavioral patterns that hold you back, you take a conscious control over your own self, you dictate how you're going to live your life how the day is going to go by deciding how you're going to feel regardless of what's going on around you that's the confidence that's what makes you sexy when people see you live your life regardless of how they're showing up this makes them so so attracted to you you don't need anything outside of you to make you happy okay prioritize yourself confidence is everything and confidence is your birthright if you're not feeling confident here's the tip for you it's important to be decisive so being decisive even about smallest things the best way to go about it that's going to work like 100% stand by it by this particular exercise is asking yourself what do you want and acting on that want desire let's say you're dressing up you're getting ready for work you can't decide on what outfit to wear apply it here okay become more decisive what do you want which one do you really want listen to your intuition and act on it indecisiveness adds onto the victim identity uh, lower states and insecurities that's why you need to develop this decisiveness and apply it i would do this exercise throughout the day about the mundane things mundane tasks ask yourself what do i want listen to your intuition and act on that the more you do this the more confidence you're developing because how your body really sees that your inner child is that you're listening to your intuition which is a big plus you're listening to your intuition your inner child is really really happy it makes you internally free your inner child is so proud of you and so happy because the inner child when you don't acknowledge it and don't listen to your intuition you start looking for approval and validation outside of you okay so when you start doing this exercise this also shows to your inner child that you're decisive and the more decisive you are this means it's the opposite of of people pleasing so you decide on what's best for you in each and every moment somebody asks you for help but you really don't want to do it you really don't want to help them you're gonna say no okay like that's what we're doing the more you do this exercise the more you're developing this confidence i promise you try it and do it today so yeah i hope this helps and follow for more